Darren McDermott, we're going to see you again on February the 28th on the undercard of the Skelton uh, Rogan show in the NIA in uh, Birmingham. But uh, the last time we saw you in action, really bad cut under that left eye, trying to rip that British title uh, away from Wayne Elcock. Uh, first of all, tell us, just uh, think back about to that night, because just like you see on your left eye, the, the scar is still there. How bad was that cut? It, it was a bad cut, uh, obviously, because he caught me on the cheekbone. There was a lot of swelling under the cut. The cut wasn't that bad, to be fair. I mean, the, the doctor only put eight stitches in uh, as a necessary to make sure they it healed uh, nice and tight for me because I knew the doctor. But uh, the cut wasn't that big. It was just the swelling underneath. Maybe, oh, a lot of people thought I should have had a chance to get to the end of the round and let the corner have a look at it, seeing as I had such a good team working in the corner. But uh, the doctor says, no, we had to stop, so that's what it was just two rounds in 2008. I know you've told me off camera there, really bad year for you. Yeah, I think I uh, shot a few Robins last year, but uh, 2009 is going to be a big year for me. I, I've got a lot of pl fights planned ahead, uh, but uh, like I said, I'm never looking in front of another fight, so uh, the fight I'm looking at now is Steve Bendel, and uh, I'm going to rip that English title away from him. So. I'm saying, I mean, you're coming back, we could say it's a first fight back after probably, you know, having a little rest after that cut. And it's not an easy fight, isn't it? A bit of a Midlands derby there for you as well, pride at stake uh, from you both being in the, you know, in the middle of the country there. And then you also, Steve Bendel, same height as you, good record, and you know, Shay, he's got a title to defend. Well, uh, like I say, I like to step up to the challenge, I think. Uh, yeah. It's all right uh, having fights where you can't switch yourself on. I could afford an, an easier opponent or a foreign opponent to come over as a journeyman or something like that, but at the end of the day, I ain't going to lift myself for them sort of fights. I want to be up there, I want to be fighting tens and 12 round fights. I want a British and a Commonwealth and maybe a European belt, so to, to come back in with a 10 rounder with Steve Bendel, who's a good companion, who's been in with all these top guys in the top 10, I think that'll be a good fight for me, and I think it'll be a good fight for Steve. Bendel is a Southpaw, how many Southpaws have you fought? I won my Midland title against the Southpaw, Southpaws down. Don't worry me at all. I mean, I, I think I said to Ronnie I'd lost against the Southpaw as an amateur, and uh, he said, "Don't worry about that." So I think Dean Powell, my manager, organised my first four to five fights of Southpaws, like just so, to get me over the over the the nerves of that against the Southpaw. But it was fine. I mean, I, I've come through all them, and I, in my fifth fight, uh, seven fight, I, I beat the number seven in Great Britain, who was a Southpaw, and I won the Midland title. So now, now, now what is there? Boxers always talk about how difficult it is to stay disciplined in between fights if you have a long layoff. How difficult has it been for you to stay focused? It has because, I mean, I was supposed to be fighting in November, so I trained for the fight in November. I got my weight down and then Christmas was on me and the fight got cancelled and I was like, what do I do? Do I end up getting on a few Christmas puddings and putting a few pounds back on? But now I've stayed in the gym. We trained over Christmas and... Uh, Dean promised me that he'd get me a fight to uh, straight after Christmas, and it, which he has, and it's ideal to be on such a good show with the Olympians that I'm on, and also uh, Matt Skelton and Rogan. Finally, just a word for your fans who might have thought they wouldn't have seen McDermott back in the ring. Well, I'm back. I'm properly back, and it's going to be a good year for 2009. Thank you very much. Thank you.